Hello everyone and welcome to this Linux goodies video on how to run WinSCP on Linux. The problem is when you move from Windows to Linux and you were firstly managing all your FTP, SCP, whatever connections on Windows, then um, WinSCP for Linux is a must. You, you need that software. I know that myself. I'm an admin of Linux server and software for the last 25 years and I've just recently, well, recently, two years ago, started to, to use Linux as my um, desktop operating system because Windows was getting a bit too annoying for me. This is Manjaro. Manjaro is my go-to Linux distribution. I first started out with Mint, but Mint was a bit too, um, let's say, um, yeah, I couldn't do all the things I would like to do under Mint that I would that I like to do under Manjaro easily. So today in this video we are going to install WinSCP on Linux. That would work under any other distribution as well because we are using Wine to do that, and Wine is uh, is not an emulator. It's uh, a software which does implement most of the Windows function functionality for Linux so that you can run Linux programs, uh, Windows programs on Linux. So let's start with downloading this. And this is a brand new installation of um, Manjaro in my uh, virtual box here because I like to have it uh, clean when I show you something. So now we are going to add and remove software and we are searching for wine. It's as easy as that. You push that button to install it, then apply, put in your password. I'm sorry for the noise. I'm recording this on my laptop. It will install all the dependencies for it. I have, I don't know, it doesn't matter. For WinSCP, it just doesn't matter what you install. You can always install things later. But I would like to install these just because um, you may need TLS on that. All right. That's what you get to install. You hit apply and it will download everything for you. At least on Manjaro and on Mint, it will, it will do the same. So, download of Wine finished. Now it will install it. It's as easy as that. And transaction successfully finished. All right, now that you have Wine installed, you can do something like um, this. Go to your file manager, go to your downloads. There you see WinSCP setup Excel. You push the right mouse button and say open with wine windows program loader bam now wine will configure itself and it would like to install packages it needs so you are doing that and here you are set up for WinSCP. you go to accept typical installation all right commander modus all right install And that's it. You get a logo, uh, an icon on the screen, and there you have it. That's wine for you. You can import all your Windows settings here and use it as you want. It's as easy as that. And if you come from Windows, um, you can import all your, um, how is it called, data or credentials from it to this installation but you actually um, want to do that in another way I will show that in the next video but this time it's all about WinSCP on Linux and that's how easily you can use it I started to transition to FileZilla um, it does not 
Filezilla has not the option to use SCP and you don't need that actually and I show you in the next video why. I hope this helped and uh, please consider subscribing or giving it a thumbs up or even commenting. I like constructive uh, comments and um, thank you for watching. Bye bye.